the limit of x squared minus 4 divided by x cubed minus a as x approaches 2 can't be evaluated directly by substitution. If we tried to plug in x equals 2, we would get 2 squared, which is 4, minus 4, over 2 cubed, which is 8, minus 8 we'd get zero over zero, and that's not gonna work. Instead, we should notice that the numerator is a difference of squares, x squared minus four, which is two squared. And the denominator is a difference of cubes, x cubed minus eight, which is two cubed. So we can factor both the numerator and denominator, and if we do, we may be able to cancel something out to fix this problem. Factoring x squared minus four, we get x minus two times x plus two, and factoring x cubed minus two cubed, we get x minus two times x squared plus two x plus four. If you don't know your difference of squares factorization or your difference of cubes factorization, study up. You wanna make sure you know those. Once we perform those factorizations, we see that we can cancel the x minus twos. This totally removes the problem. Once we cancel out those x minus twos, all that's left is x plus two divided by x squared plus two x plus four. And at this point, we can just plug in x equals two. In the numerator, we have two plus two, which is four. And in the denominator, we have two squared plus two times two, that's four plus four, plus another four, so that's 12. So it's four over 12, thus it's one third. And so our limit we find by factoring and canceling is equal to one over three.